Hello, hello everyone, and today is Sunday, June 7, so we are going to be doing the uh, um, Sunday energy reading for June 7 to the 13th, so let's see after everything, all of those emotions and everything that we have to go through last week, let's see what kind of energy they are saying that is going to be in the air that we need to be prepared of, so let's go in here. I'm just making sure they don't want me yet to put some cards. There you go. Now is the time. So we have again okay, second Archangel Ariel, second chakra Archangel Ariel, Journey. I always love that card. I don't know why. I don't know you, but I love it. Walking away, attachment. And community so with this car things are better it seems like for some of us we follow or uh, uh, we are following our call we are doing whatever, whatever we need to so I can your Ariel is still working with us during this week he keeps saying that it's about you putting yourself first but at least uh, at the same time doing what is best for others at the same time through you that he's saying that it's about understanding your journey is about to begin but Whatever it is that is about family, about friends, we're still working with them. It seems like we are telling us that in our journey, no matter that it could be a physical journey, it could be a, a spiritual journey, we need to walk away. Even that they, they are our family, they are the people that we love, it seems like we have some attachment. We need to let go of certain things that are making us stay stuck in our journey. They are wanting us to focus on our journey. Sometimes, even that things can be good, sometimes that things can be going perfectly, we need to walk away. But in this case, in the way that they're saying, it's not just that. It seems like everything in the outside is good. Everything is moving forward. It seems like whatever we go through last week is getting better this week or is getting to some kind of... Um, I would say like we are getting to some kind of... Uh, happy moments, right? There's still some emotions, there's still some attachment, still some uh, afraid feelings in there that we need to let go. They're saying, and something that they just told me to tell you, the journey is not about, the end of the journey is not about the, the making every person happy. The end of the journey is about being able for you to grow and walk away from the things that hurt you and maybe the things that are making you hold you back from others, but at the same time to create a better collective, a better communicate, a, a better community. It's about creating a unified collective, but at the same time, it's about doing whatever is best for you. Even if that means that you need to walk away from some um, feelings or some emotions that are attaching you to other people, no matter how good they are. This is your journey. This is about you. This week is going to be about you. What you need to do, what you need to analyze and do the changes and do the action that is required from you. So this is what they're saying for this week. I'm going to be watch, say, looking for the um, messages messages of the animal spirit. What is the, the other part of the higher sense of it, right? I'm still looking at the card to see if they have message. They're saying that the light is with you. You are in the right journey. You are in the right path. You have the light with you all of the time. Archangel Ariel is making sure that the messages and everything, that everything that you need, that the strength that you need is still there, that you can do this. But that means that sometimes we need to make the hard, the, the difficult decisions because at the end, it's not about just you. At the end, doing what is right by you, you're going to be able to do the right for others as well. So... But always thinking about your personal journey, your individual journey in the aspect of a higher collective journey. That's the way that it is. So let's see. We have pick up a spirit. Let it shine. During all of this process, they're saying you are not alone. You have a spirit. You have your guide. You have everything that you need. Your truth, you need to speak your truth. You need to talk about what you're feeling. Allow yourself to go through this process. But you 
it's your time. They've been saying it's time for you to do what is best for you. It's time for you to keep moving forward. So they want for you to be able to do this. They want for you to be able to shine with your truth, with your own light. Open your heart, open your mind, open your 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 truth journey and say it. You are not alone. And not just that, you have all of the knowledge, you have the intuition, you have what is required from for you to keep be to keep able to move away from those things that are not or from from those that are not helping you to shine in this journey. Because at the end we are going to be able to do something bigger for them. So allow this to happen. Don't fight it. Keep moving forward. Just flow with it. Okay, sweetie, so I hope that this reading helped you to understand what is going on, to understand what is coming to you, and see you next week.